attacking, like stepping For up. Even there. Trying, yeah. He yeah. could just see him. Like he didn't look right physically. Yeah. Like oh, James move. Harden never no attacking the basket. Yeah. Like what? He blows by everybody. Trust me, we all know what a healthy James Harden yeah. can do. <laughs> we all know, man. We and all then, know. All right. So then, did y'all? Did y'all? Oh, well, actually, let, let's play the video. I feel like you just got to do this justice. The Rachel Nichols post game with with mm. my man Chris Paul. Right. Let's do it. I'm surprised y'all haven't shot on Chris Paul yet. I, I appreciate oh, I'm it. There. Okay, okay. So let's watch this. Okay. Thing. <laughs> I think Dale's the only one that like really <laughs> good. <Yes. laughs> Better, Rachel. What does it feel like? <laughs> feel like we just lost. This is Rachel Nichols post game. The first question she asked to uh, Chris. Better, Rachel. What does it feel like? <laughs> feel like we just lost. Like, are you fucking kidding me? You know what I mean? So. What does it feel? I would be. I wish he had said more. Like, what the fuck type of yeah, question is that? Just have it bleeped out in the sports center replay. And I'm so happy. Like, it's a great feeling. You know? Yeah. yeah like, what type myself. of stupid ass question, bro? That was. This was an L for Rachel. And I just spent all last pod defending yeah, Rachel and shit. Talking about Rachel, like she's all about like the narrative of basketball. So she asked that question. She could form her weird ass narrative when she goes in the jump on Monday. And then, then her next one. <laughs> you know what I mean? So. Attack Rachel. Yeah. Knowing that for so long you worked to get to this point, is there any? I should just gonna let him respond and then just add on to the question like, like it was all when one. You worked to get to this point. You can tell he's over. Is it. there any solace in hey I've had this experience no. and I can learn from it and I might get back here? Leave this man alone. Um, he had a good game. Yeah. I mean, it take it take a while to process this a question, or whatnot, though. but it's what the same mentality. Like? No, the second one. You know what I mean? I ain't retiring. She was like, "That's what you asking." Is there That's value out. in basically so, getting to the finals? You know, not back to work. Like experience was. Dwayne. Yeah, Chris. With all due, all right, with, yeah, with all. Got that one. You thought the second one was valid? Second one was more valid. Yeah. I think when you start with that one though, like yeah, the I first like one was just past that is just. What does it feel like? What type of stupid like that was crazy. She's trying and to I, be deep with it. Like, yeah, yeah, bro. What type of stupid ass shit well, is that? It's like at a funeral. It? Like, how do you feel? Like, <laughs> nigga, I'm happy. What do you think I feel? Yeah, bro? What does like, it what feel like? Hey, her replacement though did an excellent job. Malika and is it and Malika she finds for yeah. yeah hey, bro, Malika, just, hey, that, we are gonna start that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Malika. Yeah, we start that, that, uh, that question was bad. Yeah. Um, sorry. So go on. What's what's what do you have to say about Chris Paul? I want I want to hear it. Oh man. Chris Paul, Chris Paul, Chris Paul. <laughs> Let's just say, like, Let's get it. He's, Let's one, of the, he's one of the best point guards of all time. Uh -huh. But right. then, like, I don't understand how some players get criticized to the extent they do for not having championships. But I feel like Chris Paul is the poster child for one of those players as well. And he doesn't catch as much heat. Knowing when a lot of times him not winning, he's part of the reason, too. It's not every time he gets bad luck. Like, no, like, he could have played. There's so many games in the finals where he just didn't play well. He got outplayed by Drew Hall in the biggest game of his career. Is Chris Paul a loser, Dale? I think Chris Paul is a loser on the highest level. In the playoffs, oh, so in now the he highest has a caveat. level. And at least now he has a caveat, too. The other day, he was talking about, no, he's I been a loser his whole life. <laughs> no, in the conversation, I said, it comes, he run the regular season, but in the playoffs, like he hasn't won anything. And he's fumbled a lot, too. That's a different argument than he's been a loser his whole life, but I feel what you're saying. I was pretty sure I was Don who says a loser his whole life. Now, that was with the post that you posted and agreed with, or whatever. Oh, I laughed that tweet. at it. That's different. Yeah, and I was saying, he's been a loser his whole life is hilarious. So what does yeah. that make Russ then? I mean, like, oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, if Chris Paul's a winner, how's Russ not a winner? I mean, he, nobody's. I'm not saying he's a winner though, but he's definitely not a loser. <laughs> I know. I'm saying. I think, I think like, so. You didn't go too far with it. I think people have gone too far when they're saying like Chris Paul's been a loser his whole life. My thing to that is just it's just funny. Like you can be six feet tall, get to the NBA, become a top ten point guard of all time, first ballot Hall of Famer, get MVP, to the championship, MVP candidate, lose, and then people are just like, nah, he's been a loser his whole life. Like. It's crazy how we look at these greats. Like, if, if you knew him personally, you'd be, like, so proud of the guy. Like, he is an all-time fucking great. Six feet tall, but we just, like, fans just don't care. Like, you're six feet, doesn't matter. Why didn't you win? You guys didn't, like, I don't think Chris Paul can be the best player on a team mm. and then win a ring. I think they had a chance to with the Clippers. But, like, going forward, yeah, bro, it's tough. He's also very old, and he, he showed out. That's why my thing is I'm just sad for him. Like, I'm sad for him, sad for D-Book. Y'all saw the clip. D-Book was just sitting there like, damn. Damn. Yeah, yeah that bro, shit hurt. That, that shit hurt me, bro, because it's like... Aside from everything, because I, w I was kind of like frustrated seeing them lose. It's frustrating watching guys lose. And you're looking like, damn, y'all could have won game four. Y'all could have won game yeah. three. Like, okay, so this is what happened. Y'all just got beat. Y'all flat out. Y'all got beat. 
but then you you see them losing and it's just like bro losing hurts so much like regardless like yeah. they went out there and they, they fought hard mm -hmm. regardless of their of their downfalls like the offensive boards were a frustration factor yeah but it's like bro sometimes i think we do got to just enjoy greatness because the same people that are saying shit about chris paul as soon as he passes if you were to pass tomorrow same mm -hmm. one sucking dick same yeah. way they did with kobe we remember what people were saying about kobe they're we talking remember. mad crazy about kobe at 2010 on yeah. after he started winning the championships they're going in on him Who's like they, I, Dale? Bro, a lot of people just don't Media really appreciate these people. I, don't know. Right. Bro, I was never a Kobe hater. Mm. See, he thinks I'm a Kobe hater because I defended LeBron. Nah, oh, nah, Ryan. Like, you, know, you know, you know, you know. Dale was on that shit. What if I said bad forth. about Kobe? We know we won't repeat it. We just let you live. I never we just said anything bad about Kobe. No, no, I, think, I think it was a Kobe versus LeBron. Yeah, yeah, yeah and I said LeBron of, was better. And you know, oh, you hate Kobe? I'm like, nigga, running two time right, MVP, but I'm the hater. Like, it was there was a lot of there was some disrespect at that time. I probably said Kobe sucked after Achilles because he did. No, remember when they said Kawhi was more clutch than Kobe? I didn't agree with that. No, but remember when? Yeah, they said dumb shit like that. Yeah, but also I want to ask you guys because we're going back to Chris Paul. So like realistically, like. Cause I I feel like he had a good game. He twenty six points, eleven for nineteen for the field. How many years do you guys think that he really does have? Uh, Being to, like an elite player to get a compete a, a good contract and also you know competitive wise. He's Two three years back. I think. About three years. You, you he's not going back. You to the finals. He's going to Phoenix. No, he's not going back to the finals. As the oh, as okay. like the top two guy, no, he will not be like the centerpiece. I don't think in his career team. he's going back to the finals. Really? Huh? Yeah, I don't think so. There's what rumors of him potentially going to the Lakers yeah. potentially. What if he comes to the Lakers? Do you think that? No. He, no? I don't know. I you think don't think he'll get to the championship if he comes to the Lakers? I don't know. I don't think he's going to the Lakers. Yeah, like, All right, not. okay. Playing with the hypothetical. Yeah. There's okay. been reports well, the Lakers are team. trying to get him and he's open to it. All well, right, yeah, when Magic okay, Johnson man. put it out there, as soon as the okay, finals That's a good ass team. I can't lie. I don't see anybody else beating huh? them. Who's trying to get after him? Oh, there's reports that the Lakers are trying to get Chris oh, Paul. Lakers. Chris Paul's right, potentially right. interested. Any Magic Johnson right after the finals ended. Like, if I'm Chris Paul. First call I'm taking is from the Lakers. So I'm like, just hesitant to say those. the Lakers would automatically win if they just got Chris Paul. Like I'm, kind of, I don't know. I, I think like we're I've automatically going to the finals if we get Chris Paul. Because wow. like the Clippers don't have Kawhi next year because he tore his ACL unfortunately. Really? And okay. after that, like I don't see anybody in the West unless the Warriors make a crazy move. Who's like even if they do, like it's a mass matchup disadvantage for them with Anthony mm. Davis and LeBron and shit. We would have been in the finals this year. Yeah, we would help yeah. them in the finals this year of our True. flawed team. But wow. Brooklyn is yeah. still the team to like watch out. Like okay. they're pretty scary. Kevin Durant showed me a lot these playoffs. But the yeah. trade I was hearing about for CP was fucking was it Schroeder, Kuzma, and a first round pick. Yeah, y'all think that has a chance of happening? I like if you're the so. Suns, I only the Suns would do it because why would I make the Lakers better? Yeah, it's yeah. like literally like you're lucking out. Like oh, but this it's tw the twenty second pick too. Yeah, and yeah, you were saying the fuck the even though it's supposed to be a good draft, bro. It's a pretty deep draft. Too. Yeah, number yeah. twenty two is gonna just be. We we'll probably get we we'll probably get a solid player this pick. Yeah. I'm pretty confident about it because this draft is like really deep when it comes to like good role players. 